Hey guys, welcome back to my channel where this is a February wellness update. Okay, so January I checked in, I let you know, let you know, I let you know uh, what worked, what didn't work, how my thoughts were, if I was successful, and if you have not seen that video, you need to go check it out. So um, this video is actually a little behind schedule, but I figure let me hurry up and uh, post it because we're already into March. Um, so technically I was as successful in February as I was in January. And the only trend or one trend that I notice, um, is that writing down, writing it down helps a lot. Um, a lot of time, like I could just have one off day and it just convinces me that I haven't done anything all week, all month. And I'm telling you, my little system here, my little system, I write everything down. I write down my Sunday weight. And then as I go through the week, I write down what did I do on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, and then I also circle the days that I actually work. And... As you know, if you've been here for a while, when I used to like kind of post my activities, especially when it um, when I'm outdoors, I feel like I can post a little more active update. But it's so cold out right now that sometimes the wind doesn't cooperate. But usually on my off day, it seems like I am like there's days when I'm doing like. 50 minutes, 80 minutes. One day I had a nerve to do 120 minutes in one day. But I do that because I can. I have the time and the energy. And then that way I'm not stressing on the three days that I work. So I work 12 hour, um, 12 and a half hours minimum. And then my commute alone is like 45 minutes one way. So there's a lot of time that I'm really not available, but I seem to make it work. <laughs> I seem to make it work. My goal for February was uh, to try to lose five pounds and to track at least 210 minutes worth of activity each week. Now, did I meet the tracking goal? I did, but I didn't. So there's a week Matter of fact, there's two weeks that I only tracked 185 minutes. However, the other two weeks kind of outdid the other two weeks. So then I actually met the quota if you look at like the amount of minutes for the month. So week one in February, I tracked 185 minutes. Um, week two, 410 minutes. Your girl, what was happening? Okay, I remember I took a little road trip there. Ain't that something? I took a little... Oh, no. That wasn't the week. See how I'm saying? That wasn't the week, I don't think. But usually Saturday and Sundays is when I really go hard because I'm usually off. And it just helps me clear my mind, help me set my intention for the week. Um, but I checked in with 410 minutes that... Uh, and I worked three days in a row. <laughs> Your girl was on fire. Uh, then the next week I was 280 and then the last week I was 185. So I checked 185, 410, 280, and then 185. So yes, there were some weeks where I didn't meet the 210 minute quota, but overall I met the quota. And then as far as my weight, I was kind of up, then I was down, then I was up, then I was down. So I technically lost like 3.6 pounds, which is good. Um, and really my goal, my real goal was to try to lose three pounds a month. Um, and sometimes that's not that easy, especially if you're not um, paying attention to your diet and we do have to control what we eat. I've also learned that if I meal prep, I will be more successful. And I've also learned that by looking at my vision board, it kind of keeps me motivated to do what I said I was going to do because I do not want to come to December 31st 
and do my journal entry and have a whole bunch of goals not met, especially if I didn't try. You know, it's one thing to try to do. It's like to try to get an A, but you end up with a B, but at least you tried. And at the time, the B is the best you can do. But I don't want to just not do, get an F, and then I'm complaining that I didn't get an A. That's not going to work for me. So I really like my system. Uh, wellness is looking very good on me. I've been journaling. Um, anytime I feel like I get stuck or anything, I journal about it and like I said my little calendar system here it works because it helps me see what I actually done and um, most nights I try to do a sleep meditation and I'm not even counting those minutes into my um, activity however if I do a morning meditation I do count that because you know everything counts like I said in videos in the past everything doesn't have to be a strenuous activity um, you just have to figure out what's going to work for you. And it's really about movement, showing yourself love and attention. Um, it could be stretch, yoga, bicycling, um, aerobics, steps, you know, whatever. You pick what's going to work for you. And it seems like I'm, I'm figuring out what's working for me. I just need to be um, more diligent with my nutrition. Um, like I said, if I meal prep, I'm more successful. Um, when I don't meal prep, I tend to fall victim to whatever is around. And sometimes that's not a good choice for me. So um, I hope you guys are doing what you need to do. I hope you're still continuing to tweak anything if you need to, because technically it's still the beginning of the year. We still have time to come out victorious in the end. Um, so just checking in, um, in my mind, I, I was successful, um, and I'm looking forward to seeing what March has to bring forth. So until next time, let's continue to get well together. Bye.